Steve, we saw uh, relations get pretty explosive out there over the last couple of days. Was there anything um, from Vera Coley or the Indian team that you think pushed the boundaries of um, you know, what's, what's acceptable? Oh, look, I think that's for the umpire to decide. Um, you know, Australia and, and India playing, um, there's always emotions flying around and, um, you know, we, we get a little bit of white line fever every now and then and, um, you know, I think as long as it's kept on the field, then, then it's all good. Um, there's always some, some interesting banter between the two oppositions and I think it makes it a, a, a great contest. So can you explain the incident just when you got out there? What Nigel Long's problem was with, with what had happened? Um, yeah, I obviously got hit on the pad and um, looked down to Petey and, and Petey sort of said, look up there, and I turned around and, and said, what do you reckon? And it was a bit of a brain fade on my behalf and, um, yeah, shouldn't have done that. I was looking at uh, our boys, um, so shouldn't have done that and, um, yeah, it was a bit of a brain fade. It was Jessica from the Indian camp. You guys, you guys do that. No, I don't think so. Um, I think that's probably the first time it's happened and as I said, it was a, a brain fate on my behalf. Uh, Steve, can you take us through um, the review of Dave Warner's wicket and how it made an impact of any on the um, decision whether or not to review Sean White? Um, yeah, I thought it hit Davey outside the line so I said go for it. Um, and yeah, obviously it was uh, umpire's call on the impact and then going on to hit the stumps, so that was out. Um, in regards to Sean's one, um, we weren't in entirely sure. Um, I sort of said, go, um, as in go have a look at it. And he sort of turned around and started walking. So I should have probably just put my hands up and, and done it. Um, obviously uh, we saw the replay and it was, it was missing the stumps. So uh, it would have been a nice one to have reviewed. So you, you actually do want to go for a review not to walk off, and how important was that to you in the context of the way Yeah, perhaps could have been important. Um, Sean was looking pretty good, so um, disappointing wicket at the time. Um, but that, that's the game of cricket. Um, you have to move on and, and try and do what you can from there. On more than one occasion, you were seen in a very animated discussion with the Indian captain. That does not usually happen in India or Australia this time. What was going on? Oh no, me and Virat were just having a little chat out there. There was uh, not much in it, so you know, just a bit of fun, a bit of banter, and um, you know, that's the kind of things that happen in, in this game of cricket. It's it's nice to occasionally engage in, in those kind of conversations on the field, and um, yeah, it was all in good fun. I think yesterday when we we came out and bowled, we were probably rushing a little bit, almost expecting things to happen um, instead of just getting to the basics and, and executing our, our skills. Um, you know, I think we were a little bit off with our lines and lengths. Um, probably gave them a, too, a few too many freebies um, in the first innings as well. Um, I think they probably hit five or six boundaries of, of balls that were gifted to them. Um, and I think on this wicket, it was, it was about maintaining your line and lengths and, and letting the wicket do the work. There was obviously a lot of natural variation throughout the, the game. And, um, you know, I think at times we got a bit too wide or a bit too full and um, we weren't able to um, continually hit those, those areas that we needed to hit. Um, and that sort of relieved the pressure a little bit. What we did this morning was what we needed to do yesterday. Um, and if we did that, then things could certainly be different.